My name is Dr. Angie Sudeghi. I am a practicing gastroenterologist in Newport Beach, California, and I treat people with gastrointestinal diseases or digestive problems. Well, constipation is one of the most common causes of gastrointestinal problems. People have uh, very, very hard stools, pebble-like stools, or very thick uh, cracked stools, and they're difficult to evacuate, and they have to sit in the bathroom, squeeze and squeeze and squeeze. And we all know that the laxative market, it's a multi-billion dollar industry, Miralax, Dolcolax, Senna, I mean, there are so many of these laxatives out there that people have to use every day to be able to have a bowel movement. And we all know that these things have side effects. and it's really not natural to have to use them. So it's always best uh, to treat constipation with diet and dairy happens to be one of the commonest causes of constipation and um, also lack of fiber. So the average American is consuming about 15 grams of fiber per day, which is honestly nothing. I get that in one snack or one meal. You should at least have 30 grams of fiber, if not 80 to 100, depending on how many calories you consume. I can tell you I eat about 80 grams of fiber. So whereas everyone happens to be obsessed about protein and they are always worried, how much protein do I have in my food? They should actually worry about the nutrient of concern um, and the one that's actually really deficient in the standard American diet, which is the fiber. Where does fiber come from? I'm not talking about the fiber that's in the supplements like citrusyl or uh, metamucil. What I'm talking about is fiber that comes from fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds, and grains, and of course, legumes. These plant foods that grow from the ground or grow on the tree are um, basically very rich in fiber, which uh, what it does is it stimulates the gut. So if you have diarrhea, it bulks the stool. And if you have constipation, it's, uh, it has a stimulatory effect where you could have normal bowel movements. So a normal bowel movement should look like a sausage, okay, or a banana. It should not require tons of straining. It should not require taking laxatives. So if you're having problems like that, try eating a whole food plant-based diet, which is rich in fiber, devoid of animal products, uh, meat, meaning uh, red meat, white meat, uh, which don't have any fiber, eggs, which don't have any fiber, as well as dairy. Um, that is my one recommendation, and I'm confident that if you have GI problems and you eat a high fiber diet, you will be much better off.